And this quarter's PES Win Magazine, there's a lot of great articles. And as we roll into December, you'll have time to sit down and read them. You can download a free copy at PESWin.com. And there's a, a really interesting article about offshore. There's, and there's a number of articles about offshore this quarter. Well, two Dutch companies developed a solution to really one of the industry's most persistent headaches. And when it's flange alignment. So when you're trying to connect the transition piece to the monopile out in the water, it's not really easy to do. Uh, so PES interviewed uh, Onmatech and Dutch heavy lift consultants to explain their flange alignment system known as FAS. And it started when a turbine installation needed a safer, faster way to try to align these two pieces. So if you can think about the amount of steel we're talking about, these are really massive pieces you're trying to align and put bolts in. Not easy to do out in the ocean. Uh, so what this new device can do is it can align the flanges in a couple of minutes and it can reshape deformed flanges. And Joel, as you know, everything offshore can get dinged, warped. That's pretty easy to do. So you don't want that when you have a, a heavily loaded bolt to joint like those flanges to be perfectly uh, smooth to one another and, and tight. So th these two companies, Amatech and Dutch Heavy Lift and Consultants, have come up with some pretty cool technology to speed up installations of wind turbines. Yeah, I would say anybody who's interested in wind, offshore wind, any of that sort, and you have a little bit of an engineering mind or an engineering uh, quirk in your mind, as, as I think we said earlier in the episode today, engineering nerds, um, I would encourage you to go and look at some heavy lift operations offshore, whether it is offshore wind, offshore oil and gas, offshore construction of any time or any type, even pipe lay operations and stuff, just to take just to take in the the sheer scale at how uh, at how these things are being done and how difficult that would be to manage. Think about the just tons and tons of steel and uh, trying to put these pieces together and these different things, and then. Remember that these vessels are thousands of dollars, sometimes a minute, for how specialized they are, right? So a lot of money gets put into how, the, like, when we're putting monopiles in that these transi transition pieces get put on. A lot of money has been spent on the, ver like, technology to get make sure there's super, super tight tolerances on the verticality of those when they're driving the actual piles in. And then you're doing that offshore in a nasty environment, sometimes from a jack-up vessel, sometimes not from a jack-up vessel, sometimes from a moored or like a, you know, a pseudo moored vessel on uh, dynamic positioning systems. And then you're swinging these big things with cranes and all this stuff. Like it's just a crazy amount of engineering, engin engineering and operational knowledge that goes into making this stuff happen. And if you make one little mistake, all of a sudden that piece can be useless, right? Like I've been a part of, of heavy offshore lifting for oil and gas where they've built a piece on shore, got it out to the vessel, went to go put it off subsea in 2,000 meters of water, lowered it all the way down there, and it didn't fit. Like, you just burned hundreds and hundreds and thousands of millions of dollars in time. So this kind of technology that Animatech is putting out in Dutch Heavy Lift Consultants, this is the key to making sure that these offshore operations go well. So kudos to these guys for, solve, for seeing a problem and solving a problem with a real solution uh, instead of just kind of like dreaming things up, making something happen here, I'd like to see it. Check out that article and many more in this quarter's PES Wind magazine. Download a free copy at PESWind.com. As wind energy professionals, staying informed is crucial and let's face it, difficult. That's why the Uptime Podcast recommends PES Wind magazine. PES Wind offers a diverse range of in-depth articles and expert insights that dive into the most pressing issues facing our energy future. Whether you're an industry veteran or new to wind, PES Wind has the high quality content you need. Don't miss out. Visit PESWind.com today.